Hello everyone, this is Luxury PL38. Hopefully everyone's trying to um, self-isolate as, as much as you can and also do a social distancing and please stay safe. And um, if you haven't actually subscribed to my channel, please do so because I do have a 1000 um, giveaway milestone. Today's bag of the day is obviously a Chanel bag. And as you can see from the dust bag itself, it is a big bag. It, it is actually a tote. So let's get into the actual bag itself. And this is the default tote. It was first released in 2012, so that was eight years ago. And um, let me just put that aside. And this particular bag is in leather with the gold hardware. They do come in four different sizes, the small, the medium, which is this one, and there is another one large, and also the extra large. For the leather bag itself, for the leather default tote, I've only ever seen the medium and the slightly bigger one, which is the large. I haven't actually seen the extra large or the small one in leather. They are usually in fabric or tweed materials. So I'm not too sure whether they have that in leather, but um, this is the medium size and um, the leather itself, it seems to be more durable than lambskin. It is, I would say it is scratch resistant as you can see and it is quite um, pebbled leather. You can see the pebbledness. So it is a very smooth feel to it. It is definitely smoother than the caviar leather but not as smooth as lambskin. So I don't know what kind of leather they use. It might be a calfskin pebble leather, but um, you you can see the durability of it. So let's get into the bag itself. They do come in two separate different handles. The top handle, which you can use it um, just by carrying itself, and the shoulder strap that you can use it. Let me just show that to you. The shoulder strap itself is not long enough for a crossbody. It is only long enough for a shoulder strap. And it is useful if you carry a lot of heavy things. Sometimes it's just too, too much to carry by the hand. So it is quite useful to use the shoulder strap just to swing it on your arms because of the heaviness of it. Because it does hold quite a fair bit. And this is the medium size. So let me just take that out. I actually paid this for four thousand seven hundred and twenty-five Canadian dollars. I bought this, I believe it was mid last year, just slightly under a year ago. And let me just show you. It's actually around seven or eight months ago, and the price has increased now, but it's not as bad as the classic flat. For now, the current price is $4,825, so there is a $100 increase for the medium size, which is okay in my opinion, because the classic flap increased definitely much more than that. So this is the booklet that it come with. And um, I do have the receipt here, and this is the authenticity card. It is the 28 series. So it was sometime towards the um, last quarter of last year. And let me just show you the inside, the default tote. It does have the back zip pocket. This is made in Italy, and it is in the microfiber velvet material. As you can see, let me just show you. There you go. It has that microfiber smoothness, and it does have a chain here that you can it's um you can actually put this use this as your key um it's an, it's it's quite flexible in that sense and it has that cc logo with the gold hardware and there is another front pocket here from zipper pocket and this is where you will find the serial number if you actually look if you are looking for the serial number it's actually inside the front zipper pocket And you can just close the bag with the magnetic pull if you like. But this is the default toe. It does have four feet. And that's the side of it. So it is a very structured bag. But you might need an insert if you want to keep it into that, that kind of shape. Because usually it just goes slightly outwards 
with that with that flap outwards but um, to be honest I actually do not need an insert for this and also um, if you purchase this on um, Chanel if you go to a Chanel boutique and purchase this on the receipt itself they still name this as the grand shopping tote the, the grand shopping tote which is the GST it is um, the the back itself before the default tote it was called the grand shopping tote so the Chanel website um, it's called the shopping tote and the receipt itself it's called the grand shopping tote so they did not mention it as a default tote but um, in the media itself we all call it the default tote so there you go today's back of the day is the default tote in black leather from Chanel once again thanks so much for watching